I'm away. Forest encounter. Oh, <laughs> I hope I'm right in the fact this is 100% catch rate. What have we got? Because I got a Yo. All right, let's see what I'm going to get. Okay, not amazing. Uh, it's a which means we would have to swap out, if we want this, Mistrevious and Burmy. Which I'm more than happy to do. Burmy can get in the bin, honestly. So I'm going to present you with my current dilemma. And you let me know your opinion. You're much better on the technical side of Pokemon than I am. Iron Defense, Fury Cutter, Vice Grip, and Sand Attack. I would like to learn Bite. Bite. Uh, what's Dark Super Effective against? It's Super Effective against Psychic, Ghost... Oh, it's gonna be normal anyway. It's not gonna be normal anyway. Yeah, of course, duh. It has normalized. Already this is getting in my way. It doesn't matter, yeah. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to episode two, technically, so <laughs> of our Pokemon <laughs> X and Y Soul Link. Uh, episode one, if you haven't seen it, is over on Will's channel. Will, do you want to introduce yourself? Uh, hi, I'm Will. You might notice me from things like... The Shawshank Redemption. I'm going to put like a really good movie in that little blank there. So Cool. Uh, you didn't see me. I'm not in the foreground. I'm in the background. Uh, but yeah, Callum <laughs> started on this is technically episode two. Because if you didn't see last episode... It's kind of in two parts because the trainer in front of me here has a dust noir and I had no moves to attack it. <laughs> so we've had to restart already. Um, if you want an explanation about what we're doing going forward, because this is literally the first trainer ever in the game, go watch the episode. I've explained it all there. Uh, Callum, go. Take, take it away. It's your episode. Sorry, I hijacked that. Sorry. Apologies. <laughs> it's all good. I introduced you. So... If uh, you are familiar with the channel, you'll know Will and I did a versus Nuzlocke uh, last year. This time yeah. we're going with something a little more team focused. So we're doing a soul link. Uh, again, watch episode one for all the explanations on what that means. I just say, with all the faff we had in the last episode, let's just dive straight back in. Yeah, straight into it. Um, I'm going to put all the rules in the... Right, let's go, you little prick. Um... <clears throat> I'm gonna put all the rules in the description anyway. If they... Right. Dust Noir. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm honestly just gonna put it to sleep this time and we'll on it. Oh, yeah, we did grinding in between episodes because I just. He because. needed the move. He uh, needed the move, and also our secondary mons were so weak, so we're like. Get the starters up to level 9 and secondary up to level 5 max. Yeah. And as we're Wait. doing... <laughs> Sorry, um... I thought this dust one had insomnia, so it was like I didn't fall oh. asleep. I was like, what? No! But it's just it took a turn. I oh, okay. it took a turn. <laughs> um... As we're going sort of back and forth on encounters, I'm not going to get my encounter from this first yet. Uh, I am going to go fight a trainer, though. Oh, I'm done now, so hold up, hold up. Don't go, okay. don't go. I'm, I've done that battle now. Dust Knight is Excellent. Delito. Excellent. So, so let's get a forest encounter before, because always get encounters before battles. Otherwise, mm -hmm. you might be wasting XP on something that true. could be used somewhere else. Right. I don't think I, there was a way to randomize floor items. No. So, yeah, potions are potions are potions. Right, uh, it is your turn to get the encounter. I think I got the first one. Oh, I can't remember. Oh, yeah, yeah. You got you got the first one. Yeah. I'm away. Forest encounter. For, forest in Fairy forest encounter is... <laughs> what we got? I hope I'm right in the fact this is 100% catch rate because I got a Salamance. Yo! All right, let's Yo. see what I'm going to get. Okay, not amazing. Uh, it's a Ghastly. Which means we would have to swap out, if we want this, Mistrevious and Burmy, which I'm more than happy to do. <laughs> <laughs> Burmy can get in the bin, honestly. <sighs> right, uh... Wait, you... 
do you want to throw a Pokeball first, see if it's 100% capture rate? Because I don't want to yes. yeah, mess up then the Salamence bot me one. Alright, throwing a Pokeball. I'm pretty sure it's the first two routes 100%. Caught it in one, so let's see. I mean, it was right. a level 3 Ghastly. Catch rate yeah, is different, four. but... Level 4 Salamence. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. It's got to be 100%. It's got to be 100% yeah. capture. Yes. Right, so we're getting rid of Mysterious and Burmy for this pair, yeah? All right, so. Well, my we PC yet. So I'm going to present you with my current dilemma, and you let me know your opinion. You know, you're much better on the technical side of Pokemon than I am. So yeah. Tony Pym's current attacks are Iron Defense, Fury Cutter, Vice Grip, and Sand Attack. I would like to learn Bite. I'm going to uh, keep Fury Cutter. It's a good move. Sand Attack, I think, can be really useful. Vice Grip is my only non-Fury Cutter physical attack. Or just, you know, damage dealing attack. And I, in defense, I got rid of in my first playthrough and that was a mistake but i guess that was only for the stall um bite uh what's dark super effective against it's super effective against psychic ghost um but then you have a ghastly stick on ghost types as well that's true i'd say learn it for type variation oh but we'll just get rid of though because iron defense you have crack in defense so yeah. it might not be desperately needed. Um, I say get rid of vice grip because it's all going to be normal anyway. Oh my god, you're uh, right. Yeah, yeah no, it's you're right. Be normal anyway. It's it normal has normalized. Anyway. Yeah, of course. Duh. It doesn't. It doesn't Already, matter. this What's is getting in my way. Move? It doesn't matter. Yeah. What? Just what's the strongest move? Um, I didn't actually Salamence. check. I've just forgotten it. So here we go. We'll make do. This Salamence has Scrappy, which oh will be God, super I... handy against the Dust Noir. Clicked the wrong button on my controller. I didn't rename Ghastly either. He's having a mare. He's having a mare. Anyway, I've got uh, Mr. Neil, the Salamence. <laughs> right, let's See, head on. See, in current Pokemon games, you could just rename them at will. I would love to be able to do that right now. Oh yeah, you just go to the um, po uh, Pokemon Center, don't you? Um, I can't remember how you do it in each game. Oh, I mean in, in Sword and Shield, just Pokemon Center. Pokemon Center, yeah. Go on the right, uh, left hand side, yeah, I remember. Um, I don't know if that's right. in BDSP, actually. I don't think it is. Because it's the exact same setup in the Pokemon Center as the OGs. Yeah, but I don't know if they maybe added someone somewhere. Maybe the name rater. I don't know. Oh, Callum, you know what I was saying about um, everything in my Ultra Moon randomizer? Everything that can uh, Mega Evolve will Mega Evolve. Yeah. Uh, a Sceptile's just popped out. <laughs> huh. Well, Did interesting, you... though. Oh, yeah, with a trainer. Yeah, so I'm like, when it makes a move it might mega evolve so i'm gonna have to go for flip well this is an interesting butt. thing to note for viewers no, while we doesn't... were grinding between episodes oh yeah um i accidentally saw one of the encounters that i could have had here in the forest which of course i would have preferred over ghastly um it was a mega agron a, a wild mega agron Megad. mad tin <laughs> <laughs> if I caught that, would it have stayed in its mega form? Like, I wonder how far that... Because obviously the game's not meant to find wild mega Pokemon, so I don't know if that would have messed with it in any way. If I'm remembering correctly, you have to put the Megas in the PC. Like, before closing the game, put the Mega in the PC and it stays. Okay. So I've got to keep that in mind, because I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Flinch. Wait, look, you splash. We're all gonna die. <laughs> I remember the in uh, Sword of Shield when it's like, oh, Gigantamax Waylord. Oh, absolute bullshit. It would crush the stadium. 
or like you ever imagine that? <laughs> just, <laughs> that's like a cartoon waiting to be made of just go waylord into the <laughs> holographic pokeball thrown out and just a waylord falls from the sky <laughs> Honestly, just... by grinding up to that level 10 earlier, feeling real OP right now. <laughs> uh, I mean, I just feel OP because I've got level 6 Salamence. Get get out of my way. Get and out of my Shauna car. is willing to heal my Pokemon at any moment. Oh, yeah. Oh, a Gabite. That would have been way better. Uh, that would have been... Although we couldn't have paired it. You would have had to re-roll. Do you have a Dragon type? Yeah. Salamats. Oh god, yeah, obviously. The one you literally caught. Um, so yeah. Oh so wait! Do I what? have to re-roll anyway? Because I went and caught that ghastly. Oh no 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 no. So if we trade out Burmy and Mistrevious, then we can put Salamance and Ghastly on the team. Okay. So don't We don't have Burmy. access to a PC right now, so I just don't we use Burmy. Just don't use Burmy. Okay. So if it like you get Roared into Burmy, you have to switch out. And if my other two die, that's just game over. Yeah. Because Burmy and Mistrevious aren't on the team right now. Cool. We just can't get rid of them yet. Oh god, what am I doing? I need to oh, run heck, from this. Why am I trying to attack this ghastly? I can't because I've normalized! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> did not yeah did not even think about that yeah oh wow yeah you're gonna train up that gassy then sunshine yeah <gasps> right so when we get out of um the forest and get an encounter route three and then i don't remember x and y well but you can go to a little area top right of the next town for another encounter, can't you? Yes. So wait, you get two more encounters this episode. We can actually build a, a good team and get a team going. Oh, I'm liking having hypnosis though. That'd be huge. For That's a nice early action. move to have. I just realised Salamance is the one dragon line that doesn't learn dragon rage. That could have been massive. Oh man. Where's my water? Mm. So, speaking of BDSP and nicknames and all that, mm -hmm. Legends Arceus. I've not. I've been trying to avoid trailers. Oh, really? <laughs> as as of recording, it comes out in 13 days. Honestly, like, I. You know, it's obviously to each their own. I don't think you need to avoid trailers. Um. All the trailers up until two days ago were basically the same. The reveal trailer. <laughs> um, there was a 13-minute demo the other day. They put out a 13-minute gameplay demo video. Um, that did talk about some more stuff, but barely anything. They've, like... It's, it's interesting how little they've shown. People are concerned about it. I'm not particularly. I'll be surprised if we get in there and it's actually a tiny little game. I think they're just not showing us lots. When Sword and Shield came out, we barely saw any Galar Pokemon. Um, yeah, that's because they'd never announced Impidimp. <laughs> announce um, Impidimp. <laughs> yeah, Impidimp justice. Um, yeah, it's because they've learned that they just show all their cards way too soon sometimes. Yeah. Just go, here's everything. And you're like, well, cheers. Great. Where's so, they announced? A handful of Galar Pokemon, didn't they? they yeah. They didn't even show the last evolutions of the stars, did they? No, no. <clears throat> um, and I, I do want the final evolutions of the Arceus starters to leak because the theory is that there will be Hisuian forms, and that's why we haven't seen them yet um, mm. in game. And if that's true, I do want to know what they're like before I pick a starter. <laughs> um. <laughs> Because out of the three, what is it? It's Typhlosion, it is Cyndaquil, Rowlet, and... Cyndaquil and Rowlet. Cyndaquil and Rowlet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no one, no <laughs> one's going Oshawott. Yeah. But no again, one... it depends. If there's a Hisuian Samurott that looks particularly awesome... Oh, that could have, like, pure, like, ninja style to it. Because that would fit in with the game. It fits in with the Pokemon lore around it. 
Yeah, I'm, That's exactly it. So depending on what these Hisuian forms, if they're even real, there might not be. But if there yeah. are, I want to see what they look like before I pick. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so I'll tread lightly on this as to not spoil anything because you've not seen trailers. I don't know what you have and have not seen. Have you seen... Oh, I could have had Nine Tails. Um, have you seen the thing about noble Pokemon? Like Cleavor? Yes, the last trailer I watched was Cleavor. And at that point, I was like, I don't want to know anymore. <laughs> like, That's fair. <laughs> That's I was like, totally okay, fair. I know there's now going to be new mons. It's not just going to be a lore-based game that actually introducing ancient Oh mons. my god, like, am I going to lose Ghastly? Don't you dare, that is my It's science. alive, it's alive. I'm, panic happened? I'm panicking because... Okay, it's wild, so... Just I try switch. and run. Well, it's a Nine Tails. I'm worried if I switch to Tony Pym. Oh. The Steel type against the Nine Tails using Flamethrower. No, the Steel uh, Bug I've type. I've done it anyway. I, it's it's a level 11 against a level 5. Oh, and it used Confuse Rate. Okay, I can run. Because I'm out of the forest now. I'm waiting for you. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. There was a trainer battle. Don't you and dare now... lose my Salamence. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to a soul link. <laughs> All right, I'm coming to the end of the forest now. To be fair, on the layout, as at the minute, like I say, I just looked at the game and the OBS layout I have. Um, I said, oh yeah, can you record bottom screen because I've got it on the layout. I'm looking at bottom screen, there's not much on it. It's like either attacking moves or friends acquaintances or, passes by. Yeah, that's true. I might, I might see if I rework the layout. Because that's just excess footage that's going to increase the size of the video and it's just not worth putting in. Good thing I spotted that. Shouldn't that make too be... much of a difference, like export wise. No. But no, what I'm saying is like getting it in and then cropping it down, then fitting yeah. it, and then making sure it's synced. I'm like, it's not. After doing it last season, last series, um, if there's not right, anything I'm on, on route the bottom, three now. You're on Route 3? I think it's your encounter. Do you do... So Will I be able to get one without battling? Oh, yeah, I can. Yeah. All right. It is... A Zeb Striker. Electric? We don't have an electric type yet. We don't. Nice. All right, let's try and put this boy to sleep to make it an extra easy catch. No, this isn't 100% anymore. Oh, baby. Oh, no. Oh, no? What What primary is Durant? Because I've got a Morwile. Morwile. Uh, let me check. We will have a Megastone somewhere in this game. Is it Bug Is Morwile steel? steel first? It's primary steel. It's only... Oh, it's Steel Fairy in this game, isn't it? Primary is Bug. <gasps> it's yeah, Bug Steel. Baby. Bug Steel. We could have a cracking team. Okay. All right. Please catch this Zeb Striker. I don't know what its catch rate is like, but it's level three. It's asleep. One, two, three. Zeb Striker is mine. Okay, right. More wild. Guess we're going to use Yawn. Will a water gun kill him more wild? I don't know. That was a lot of XP. I forgot, yeah, we're now getting XP for catching Pokemon as well. That's dope. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. Um, I'm not sure whether to water gun this. I might just swap back mm. into Salamence. Because I've got it to go to sleep. I've got Yawn on it. It's going to go to sleep next turn. Bite is not very effective. Okay, that's fine. That's my plan. All right, now let's battle these school children. <laughs> Who is now an adult woman? They grow up so fast these days. <laughs> oh, a Floridus. I mean, it's level two. No crits. No crits, please. And it avoided my hypnosis. I don't think I can hit it again. It's in yellow and it looks like I'm doing like a third. So I don't want to. Let's see. Come on, you're asleep in yellow, Mulwa. One. Nope. Okay. 
Can confirm, not 100% capture rate. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. That's over with, I guess. Oh, shit. I just realized it has Fairy Wind and I've got a Dragon type out in the minute. Oh, boy. Okay, we're going back. That going is the big concern. Back to Turbo. Because, heck me. I'm not going to... If you lose my Salamence, that's on you. <laughs> if I lose my Salamence, that's embarrassing. Don't lose him on my Ghastly. It's it's doing well at the moment with its hypnosis. And to be fair, this uh, Wall has Astonish and Fairy Wind, which is super effective against both my Mons. So ah. like, let's just catch this quick, yeah? I couldn't Hypnosis Bulbasaur because it surrounded itself with a mist of some kind. However, it just got burned because of Flame Orb. Interesting choice of item. <laughs> Why did I use a Pokeball? I wasn't bloody asleep. <laughs> Alright, well, Lick is not doing much. Uh, what does Spike do again? Uh, gets rid of their PP. Oh. I'll just switch yeah, it knocks to... it down by like between 1 and 5, I think. Switch out to Tony. Come on, mobile. Join our team. No. I mean, I could go back into Salamance and try another bite. But I might kill it. If I get a high roll. You got any healing items? Yes. Got uh, picked up a potion in the forest. Is it worth using that first just so Salamence has full HP when you send it in? Yeah. Or do you risk your current mon dying? <clears throat> no, no, if it astonishes me, it's not gonna kill me. That's fine. Oh, you just taunt you. Ah, oh, that's ve well done, Morwile. Sure, will you still I now can't Pokemon? use Yawn. <laughs> no, you won't. Okay. Uh, I think I might go to Salamance and see what I can do. Uh, feel like Mr. Neil. I still find it weird in 3D Pokemon games that Need Arena stands up. Like, I know a lot of its art was always shown kind of on two feet, but I always thought it was like when a dog or a cat gets up on two feet for a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, like a bit, a bit, a bit of a like an action shot. Yeah, but seeing it stand like that, I don't know why it's weird to me. Uh, I'm gonna go for a uh, actually, could you see rage or headbutt or something? What Pokemon are you fighting again? More while, use headbutt. Oh, you're still on the encounter. Oh no, killed it, killed it. Oh. Uh, what Does that mean I can't use my Zeb Striker? You can't use a Zeb Striker, mate. Uh, <laughs> Oh. Okay, part of me wants to just beeline to the town, heal up, and then go for that next encounter. Yeah. So I'm not going to fight the trainers. I'm going to see what the next. Let's go see what the next encounter is, and then we can use the trainers as XP. I'm I'm on the Wait. second trainer now, so I'm just going to finish this up. <clears throat> I think there's two more trainers in that route. Oh, and we need to put in Birmingham as previous. Yeah. <gasps> and Callum. Callum! What? In this Pokemon, this Pokemon Center, there's a second Mart. A second randomized Mart. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, we could get something good. If a randomized Mart has, like, a Master Ball in it, do, can we buy it and use it? <laughs> oh, yeah, you can buy one. Like, obviously, you can't buy, like, either every Mart we find with, like, a Lucky Egg or a Master Ball in, we can buy one from each one. Okay, that's fair. Because... That's not obviously. Not yeah, can't stock up on master balls there. and then guarantee all your captures. Yeah, but if a yeah, Pokemon I get has it. A lucky Trevor, Pokemon, Pokemon centers are wonderful. Ooh, right, so Fox Mistrevious need to heal, then see what that second Mart's looking like. <clears throat> I do like the quality of life change of putting everything in a Pokemon Center. It's just something like. You wouldn't think of until you do it and go, oh yeah, of course, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay, right. so, 
Okay, so it's pretty normal so far. They've got Pokeball Potion. So is it the second guy that's randomized? Yes, the second guy is always randomized. All right, what are you selling, my man? <laughs> oh, well. So, Spooky Plate and Me Meadow Plate. I'm not expecting to get an Arceus. However, I can get a Cover Fossil or a Root Fossil. Ah, uh, and then if I find a fossil, we can use them. Uh... Babiri Berry, Iron Ball, uh, Iron Ball, sorry, I don't know why I pronounced that weirdly. Spell and Berry, or a Max Revive. Which is no use. Yeah. I think that the only interesting thing I've got is Charcoal. So if I get a Fire Type, I can come back here and get it. Oh, uh, so I can't grab a Fossil. Oh, no, you can. I just gotta, you just gotta wait till I find one so you can. Oh, fair, uh, okay. No. How Which one's fossils cover fossil again? Cover? You're gonna have to check. Yeah, cover fossil. Pokemon that once lived in the sea. Is that Tortuga? Yes. Is that a fossil? Because I got the. It is, because yeah, I got it is cover Tortuga. Fossil Ultra. Uh, and root fossil is Lily, isn't it? Yes. Um. Do you. Are you already covered with those? What's the lead type? Okay, Tortuga is an island. Uh, Tortuga <laughs> Pokemon is a water rock type. Do you have any water types? No, but it's going to be randomized, isn't it? It's not going to be a Tortuga. Oh yeah, of course it's not. What am I doing? Um, well, they're both a thousand. I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy one. Why not? Let's get the cover fossil. Right, so. Like that. So it's Route 22 next to the top right of the town. Yeah, I'm going to buy a couple of potions and Pokeballs. Ooh, potions. Should probably get some. <clears throat> Can't believe I lost them all while. So I would ask Google yeah, no, what, I? <laughs> um, what the catch rate is for more while. But I don't know if higher is better or worse, so I, I generally don't know how catch rates work. Okay, so deposit Burmy. <coughs> and deposit Zeb Striker. Oh. Is Zeb Striker go in a death box or release it? <laughs> I'm just putting it in a box. I think we have to battle eight. We have to battle a trainer before we can get to the next encounter. Yes, there will be one, yeah. Oh, I'm not looking forward to getting the roller skates. I was, I've never been a fan of those. I mean... Okay, it's one of those things where, Of course, it's nice to have. And it, but no, it, did, it doesn't even replace the bike. And the bike, I'm pretty sure you get in the next town anyway. Do you? No, but it, it replaces running. Well, you can still run with the D-pad, to be fair. Huh, speaking yeah. of Tortuga, this trainer has a Caracosta. <laughs> he went to the mart and got it. He went to the mart and got the... I bought this from the mart. So. There's a fun fact. In a lot of the early documentation for planning the Gen 1 games, uh, there is a lot of artwork... Uh, that seem to be the ability to buy Pokemon from shops. Um, a lot of artwork of shopkeepers with just shelves full of Pokemon in cages. Wow, that's dark. That's really Gen dark. 1 was, like, especially like all the pre-planning stuff. I mean, um, you know, there's the all trainers, sales, including, you know, Red, you, the player, uh, mm -hmm. had a whip. Oh, no, I know that one. Bloody and yeah, many of the trainers it. in Gen 1 still do, like, of the actual game that came out. I mean, the um, Rocket Grunts do. I think the... So do some of the regular trainers. The bikers do, I think. Yeah. Uh, I, uh, I'm i ready to get my encounter. Are you nearby? I'm battling the Caracosta. Uh, this is the trainer on Route 22. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm liking having get... Fury Cutter, though. Get stronger every Because this is a maybe? tanky Caracosta, but I'm actually managing to do something about it. Because if you're a cutter. Even if Rinted. it is reduced to being normal type. 
Uh, we can't use this pair. My encounter for Route 22 is a Scolipede. So we can, <sighs> we can catch it, but I can't go on the team. Is there any point in me <laughs> checking one? Is this just not going to screw us for the rest of the game if we can't get a third Pokemon? <laughs> That's the fun of a Soul Link. <laughs> That's the challenging bit. Sounds more like the detriment of a Soul Link. <laughs> I mean, of five encounters, we've got two Pokemon. <laughs> uh, I mean, we have three. We just we can't use one of them at the minute. So this one, unless... Oh, it's, it's okay. It only would have given me a Nummel anyway. I mean, catch it, because that's still a pair if we lose our starters. Yeah, that's true. Okay, yeah, I didn't think about it like that. Like so once so once the the type in a previous pair has gone yeah you can replace it cool can we not that we will because these pokemon are not amazing um but could we just swap them out if we wanted to oh yeah you because we did that earlier things. didn't we with ghastly yeah, yeah. and salamence so, yeah scolipede well i'm not saying the ball let's put it to sleep Called the Nummel. I think it's Numel, but I've always said Nummel. Yeah, I've always said Nummel. Go Nummel. Sounds better than Go Numel. Numel. Such a sad-looking Pokemon. It's <laughs> just got a big sad face. Yeah, but so do I. <laughs> oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. no. <laughs> Right, come on. Catch. Do it. Do it. We're approaching half an hour. Yeah, mine's just I've been recording for 30 31. Minutes. Yeah. Uh, right, come on. Ugh, poisoned. I don't have any antidotes. Shit. Okay. Well, go to sleep, please. Scolipede. So I can catch you. Because I can't hit it again. It's like scraping red. One, um, two, shall I just three. wait for that? Lovely. Yes, caught it. Grand. Nice. So, we have got Route 22, Scolipede, and Nemel. <laughs> Alright, so next episode will be... It'll be the gym, won't it? No, nothing else to do. Cool. Uh, what should I name Scolipede? Randy. Oh my god, I didn't name Nummel either. Oh my god. What it's are so you bad. doing? I never, I never nickname Pokemon. It's just not something I've done. Nah. So I never remember to in this Nuzlocke. Alright, Randy's not holding anything. And has got Iron Barbs, which should be useful. Oh, I should I go pop him in the box. I just realised I didn't do yeah, that. Yeah, before we forget. So going into the gym, we have only got two Mons. Yep. You have and to battle I've... the guy outside the gym first, I think. Oh, okay. Mm. Not that that's a big deal, but... No. What's the best pair we could have, then? I think we have the best team, the best two mons we can use in a minute. Yeah. Alright. Box 7's gonna be my dead box. Me. I mean, what is the Vivalon? I think the... The highest level in the gym is 13. Ah, uh, we'll be okay then, I reckon. Yeah, we'll be fine. Um, well. Yeah, we just right, passed we're good to call it there. Yeah, man. Cool. Well, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I hope you're enjoying so far our struggles uh, <laughs> to get through this game with any kind of uh, sizable team. Um, as mentioned before, episodes are going back and forth between my channel and Will's, so be sure to check out Will's channel for both the first episode and the next episode, number three. You'll find a link to his channel in the description. Thank you very much for watching. Will, is there anything you want to sign off with? Yes, on the subject of episodes, it was said in the last episode, but uh, we recorded the first series in 
a three month lockdown in England. Um, so episodes could be quite regular. I'm now at work and I'm the one who edits the episode. So we're aiming for three episodes a week, but we can't really give you specific days. Sometimes it might be two, it'll be two minimum, but we can't give you specific days as and when they will go up. Yeah. <laughs> Apologies. But yes, this is, this is the Soul Link now. We are catching pairs we cannot use. We are having to rearrange teams <laughs> to make sure we have the best teams. This is a Soul Link. So I'm going to enjoy this project, I think. It's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, me too. All right. Uh, thank uh, you very much. And remember to pop over to Will's channel and keep an eye out for episode number three. See you later. Have a good one. Bye.